is Niall O'Brien. I am 32 years old. I'm a front-end web developer at Cloud. I am based in Waterford City, Ireland. Okay, um, so for me, remote working means um, work-life balance. Um, so that's the main thing for me that I was looking for. Um, I found I didn't have that balance in previous roles. And so that was what made me start to look elsewhere. And you know, if that was abroad, then so be it. I uh, come across Clock a number of years ago, and, um, I, and in between getting different jobs, etc., I always kept my eye on Clock. And I felt that I, I came to the point in my life where I really did want a better work life balance and what I was getting. And um, when I saw an opportunity come up with Clock, um, I went for that. How my mates just didn't feel valued. Um, we, we did use a lot of communication tools and I do pop over to the office uh, whenever I can as well. But um, of course, yeah, not, not being able, not being in the room with your co-workers you know, can be a little difficult all right at sometimes, but um, it's just like anything else you adjust to. Um, I think the main thing was that um, a lot of jobs up front, they're not, a lot of jobs won't won't tell you how comfortable they are up front with regards to remote work. So before I even applied for the job, I got in contact with, um, who's now my manager, Ben Edwards. I got in contact with him online and I said, is this, I asked him straight up, is this position open for uh, remote employees? And he said, yeah. So straight away, he's just been able to tell me that, yeah, we are open to remote work. You can apply for this job. That was huge for me. Uh, the best part for me working remotely is, uh, as I said, my work-life balance. So um, I had three kids at home and I kept pretty busy with them at times. Um, I found that with previous roles, um, it could be something silly, like a, not silly, but something small, like a doctor's appointment or something like that. Um, I've had managers um, kind of put me aside and speak to me regarding you know, how much maybe my, yeah, my home life can impact work or I, I can get a perfect example was um, in a previous role, I informed my manager that um, myself and my partner had to bring one of our little ones to the hospital and um, they didn't seem overly happy with me just telling them that. And this was in the middle of the work day and, and I, I had kind of felt um, that I was more informing them as opposed to asking them especially when it comes to a huge emergency like that. Um, so I, I don't have that with clock and you know, everybody knows that you know, work-life balance is important to everybody. You know, working for money isn't the only objective in life and, and enjoying what you do is very important. So long as work gets done and so long as you can look after your own family as well, I, I think everyone's on the same page at the company. Okay, how do I stay motivated? Um, I still meet up with a lot of my friends um, who are in the industry. So even though I'm not working beside other people that are in the industry, I still do meet up with them and, and we talk about ideas and, and things that we're doing in our own individual role. And that motivates us to kind of keep, uh, keep pushing things forward and maybe even bringing in some new ideas into each other's roles. Um, within our own team, we have weekly meetups and uh, we talk about the kind of things that the industry at large are doing and what certain things we could um, bring into uh, our own job. Um, outside of that, uh, I spend a lot of time with my family. Um, and I, I, don't know, I just keep up with tech and uh, I find that that just motivates me to keep up. A lot of people have the uh, misunderstanding that oh, if you're a remote worker, maybe you just sit around in your underpants all day or something, but I've always worked in office environments, so I still stick to core hours. And I still take my lunch at one o'clock until two o'clock. Um, I do work a little later than what I would have done in previous roles, but that's no problem. I still start at nine o'clock. Um, and, and yeah.